beautiful, strong, happy and healthy people. We are day four here in Cairns, Brook Douglas and right now we are on our way to Dane Tree Rainforest. So the weather is raining quite a bit but it is supposed to stop in a few hours but the sky looks pretty grey. And also this morning when we are laying in bed the weather map says it's not raining and it was clearly <laughs> pouring. So we have trust issues at the moment but we are hoping just like every other day it just rains in the morning and then it gets really clear throughout the day. So wish us luck on that. So right now we're on our way Train. to find Train. a ferry uh, that we're supposed to hop on to go into the Daintree Rainforest. So usually people do the Daintree with a guided tour and we decided not to do that and we're going to try you and... decided? Yes. I decided we're not going to do that and Long we're going to figure out how to do this The rain, the forest, it's not a good idea but... So hopefully we don't get lost on a deserted forest. Oh, with some crocodiles. And we're hopefully we can find a crocodile boat to a trip while we're there. So our friend just said the ferry tickets are twenty dollars each way. So our friend just said that there, he knows someone near here that we can go pick tickets up for free, so we can get free ferry tickets. So we'll see how that goes. So our next adventure begins. <laughs> so we found the little school in the middle of nowhere, yeah. and we have got she our say, tickets. Don't have school. Don't have school until the last minute. <laughs> yeah, I was like, there's no school here. There's no school here, and then we found a school here. This place is actually really funky. So we got tickets and a little hand drawn uh, map. See? And no names. <laughs> Your name's spelled right. Okay, we have found the ferry stop. I think we just sit here and wait for a ferry now. We, seem to be we only are the first ones. We're the only ones here, so I wonder if we have just missed a ferry. Yeah, it's there. It's just. Uh, <laughs> it's not that far. Can we outside the river? Yep. Okay, we just missed the first ferry. <laughs> and we'll wait for the next one. Means we'll be at the front, means we get off first. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then we go on our rainforest adventure and figure out what to do. Thanks, Eden. You are the best. Thanks for the tickets. Mm. And a big map. You're going to visit your dad as well. You should not get lost. Because don't have any service here. Okay, she's in charge of the map. Uh, something wrong. It's upside down. <laughs> okay, what's our first stop? Alexandra, Alexandra, it's the painter if you come from uh, Alexandra. Alexandra, look out. What is the cows? I don't know why they call it cow bay. Why are those vacas? Got those vacas. Right? Where's the vacas? So it's okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Is the back of it or the front of it? Or the front of it? Uh, anyway. 
So they're called the four o'clock moth because at four o'clock in the afternoon is when you see them flying around. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then we come back and see we know more about us, No. <laughs> she is getting naked in the bush right now. My button for everyone in the forest. Everyone in the forest gets to see his Brazilian sausage. <laughs> Crocodiles, do you like a uh, Brazilian barbecue? <laughs> so, our buddy's dad has taken us under his wing for the day and we have been to his farm and we got to try all the like foods and stuff around his farm and now he's taking us to a creek where he's going to cook us lunch and he gave us fresh coconut and Thiago is going to go for a swim and hopefully we see some crocodiles. Look for some Brazilian barbecue. <laughs> Brazilian meat. Brazilian sausage. What is it? <laughs> What's the Brazilian sausage? Calabresa. Calabresa. Can we cook it out? Calabresa. Fresh calabresa. <laughs> <laughs> Normally they paint their face, but you just put your arm in. Okay, so they could paint the whole body up and stuff like that. Yeah. It's me here. Yeah, it's just not a fish and fly fish. Here? Yeah. Oh, it looks it's great. Yeah. yeah. Man, that smell. Hmm. Wow, that's such a strong peppermint. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so much <laughs> Wow, that's such a cool looking bug. A bit higher up, higher up, higher up. Oh, I did it. Oh, oh, yeah, oh. did. That is very brave. <laughs> it's crawling around now. <laughs>
evolutionary process going on. But mankind won't be destroyed. The fact that you and I are working here today is evidence of that. There's a such thing as a tree kangaroo. I have never seen a tree kangaroo and I am Australian. Have you seen a tree kangaroo? Mm -hmm. No, just the sign is up. <laughs> <laughs> so we are now driving down out of Daintree Bay Forest off to our ferry. What a day. We have definitely experienced Daintree in a very unexpected light. So we got the guy we met on the cruise boat that we on the boat we went on when we went snorkeling. His dad Yo, lives here, amazing. and his dad took us on his wing for the day, Mr. and Mark. he took us around his property, and we got to eat off all the trees and all the berries, and we Tiago got sugar cane, and then he took us to, and then he took us to the water hole, and then she got to go swimming, and then he made us lunch, he made us a tea, it was delicious. So he made us a mango smoothie, like he took care of us, and we got to see Daintree the way that. Tourists generally don't do, don't get to go see Dane Tree and explain all the trees and see all the bugs and the got sprayed by your peppermint bug. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're on our way out and we've got about an hour and a half till we get home. And we're gonna get home about seven.